北海道出身エイデンこと木村伊吹さんによります同調圧力は善化です木村さんよろしくお願いいたしますみなさんこんにちは北海道から参りました木村伊吹こエイデンこと木村伊吹です今回僕のスピーチでは同調圧力について考えました今の日本で同調圧力がどうあるのかどうあるべきなのかについて話しますよろしくお願いします I sometimes feel suffocated living in Japan This is because I grew up in a rural elementary school and developed my life with my individuality at full throat I didn't care about the student around me and participated in class whether the answer was correct or not. I attended school in Sapporo from high school. <laughs> the school was enormous, so I found myself putting a lid on my individuality. I became less positive and began to fit my salaries. My personality was totally, totally different for my middle school and my high school. It was then that I had an opportunity to talk someone overseas. I was interested in for learning about foreign cultures and speaking English, so I enjoyed a lot. Then I started working part-time at a resort in Iseko, and I enjoyed communicating in English even more. Foreigners were very friendly, and even complete strangers talked well. In addition, they were very positive, and they were enjoying their life very much. That's what happened to me. It seems that people in Japan live in a, live in a sense of confinement. What do you think are different between Japanese and those foreigners? I thought it might be the Japanese language and peer pressure. English is positive language and few barriers based on age or title. On the other hand, Japanese has a own reflex and humble language and there are many different ways to use them in society. So I sometimes feel too homer. In addition, they are both positive and negative aspects regarding peer pressure in Japanese society. In the first place, Japanese people live in, a, live, in a, live in a society that respects harmony among people. And Japanese has, Japanese has been a country of compassion which values its time with neighbor and ancestors. The peer pressure was working in a positive way. Recently, However, I think it's headed in a bad direction. Too much consideration will lead to peer pressure. We only care about what others are saying, and we can't listen to our, our own voice in our heart. And we don't even know what our opinion or opinions of others are. And the coronavirus exposed this confinement. The mass police were also in that movement. I hope that this bad pressure will not continue in the wrong direction. I have not always confined living in Japan. I just felt that the way, way as a result of carrying too much my salaries as I grew older. Sometimes my, my express my opinion and individuality, I can be antagonistic. But if you are afraid of that, you can do anything. So I want to get out of that kind of peer pressure and I want to be able to accept myself and others caring too much about them. Thank you for listening. Thank you, Aiden, for a really uh, fascinating speech. Um, 
You make some really good points there. I think you're right. English does tend to be a bit more casual, a bit more universal. Uh, the way to make English more polite is to just make it less direct, whereas Japanese has completely different words and different structures used for, for different situations, so that can definitely have a feeling of confinement placed upon you. I think, I think that's a really good point. Um, there are two basic types of societies in the world. There's you know, individualist societies, which you know, focus more on the individual person, and then more collective societies that focus more on what's best for the group. And um, I think there are extremes on both sides, right? If you go completely individualistic, that's bad because you only care about yourself, you don't care about anyone else. Whereas if you go completely collective, that's also bad because, like you said, like you experience, you felt like you were losing your identity. You were suppressing your true personality. And that does lead to things like bullying, uh, abuse. Uh, in more extreme situations, you look at things like what happened in uh, fascist countries and how they turned against the other. Um, so that's a, it's a very fine line I think we have to walk. I think you do a good job of illustrating that. So thank you. Thank you. で、合わす、合わすことが当たり前だった社会ひょっとしたらこの同調圧力は逆に平和な世界を作るのかもしれない。でもみんな自分勝手に動くのがいいよって教えてるから、お互いに喧嘩したり戦争したりするわけですもんね。だから、非常に難しい、素晴らしいテ